Hi everyone, I'm Katie Nobles. And I'm disability attorney Michael Weiner. And you're watching The Bottom Line. Today's topic, will my car and house payments be reduced while receiving disability benefits? Michael, break it down for us today. Thanks Katie. So we get a lot of questions from our clients or potential clients who want to know about uh, you know how they're going to be able to support themselves while they're applying for disability or even once they're receiving disability How are they going to be able to make their payments? You know they have a car note They have a mortgage or a rent payment that they need to make and they're not sure how they're going to be able to make ends meet um, And you know these are the things that are the scary reality for people when they become disabled is they just don't have the same income that they had previously Mm -hmm. um, and you know, one of the things that I'm very proud of here at Liner Legal is, uh, and we've introduced her to everybody before, Jordan, per uh, Jordan Peritor, who works with our clients to try and help them navigate those uh, challenges. But unfortunately, you know, there aren't any specific laws that require your mortgage company to lower their payments for you or your, uh, you know, car, uh, whoever's holding the, the promissory note for your car to reduce the payments. However, what we have found is that when people are transparent with, you know, their, their lenders, about their situations, oftentimes they are able to work things out so that they can maybe increase like the term of their repayment to make payment amounts smaller. You know, people at the end of the day, they just want to have uh, loans repaid. You know, we, we do everything that we can to help our clients try and figure out a tricky financial situation. That's right. And if you need help or if you have any questions, you can visit our website. That is linerlegal.com.